Example 2.2. In this example, a vacuum gauge is connected to a chamber which reads 5.8 psi and at this location the atmospheric pressure is equal to 14.5 psi. The goal of the problem is to determine the value of the absolute pressure in the chamber. In this example, we're measuring vacuum pressure, therefore we're related with the atmospheric and with the absolute values using this relationship. The vacuum pressure is equal to the atmospheric pressure minus the absolute pressure. We are looking for the absolute pressure, so we solve this equation for the absolute pressure, which is equal to the atmospheric minus the value at the vacuum. We substitute the values and we have 14.5 psi minus 5.8 psi which gives us 8.7 psi. Please recall that the vacuum pressures are those that are below the atmospheric pressure. 